I don't want to be hungry. I want to be fed. I want to be filled. You know, fully on all this other stuff that they're throwing out there. I mean, there's a lot of this stuff on YouTube that they more confusion than a uh, than a being. It makes it would make a person so confused they'd be like a a, a mouse in a maze that had his nose cut off. Tell you what. You know, you got so many preaching different things and strange things. None of them is really preaching the true, the true doctrine, the true message of Jesus Christ. Not any of his messages that he taught, nor what the apostles taught. They're teaching their own thing. Out the door with the, the teachers, and you know, let the student take over. That's what it amounts to. But I'm hungry. I'm tired of all the riffraff. I want to be fed, don't you? I want my soul fed, and, there, and there's a lot of people out there who's lost, who's hungry, and want to be fed. But what they're getting is scraps. That's what they're getting, and then ain't, and, you know, when you get scraps, you don't want it. Fooey with it. Go off somewhere else, you know. If you're going to starve, starve to death on nothing better than what they're, the, the people out there giving you, that's the way a lot of them feel. A lot of you out there who's feeding people scraps, you're going to answer to what you're doing. But man, I tell you one thing. Man, I'm hungry. I want my soul fed. I don't want it fed with scraps. And I don't want it with little pickings, you know, that wouldn't even fill a mouse. Wouldn't even fill a fly. <laughs> yeah. Tell you what, some of them out there were enough to confuse anybody. Tell you what, you guys out there, once you quit trying to preach your own doctrine and trying to preach a little bit of Jesus Christ, how about preaching the message of the cross? How about preaching those messages that the apostles taught and quit preaching your own stuff? Quit preaching what Tom and, and Harry and, and Sally down the road preaches and start preaching what the apostles and Jesus Christ taught. How about that, hmm? I'm hungry, aren't you? It's time we get rid of the, the scraps and the little ni little pickings and stuff. And so let's start putting real meat on the table. <laughs> oh yeah. Let's lap it on. Put some nice thick gravy on there too. And some taters. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. <laughs> oh yeah. Get all that stuff out. Fill you up and fill you up good. <laughs> nice big homemade fresh hot bread, you know, ooh, mm -mm. Ah. put some butter on it, oh yeah, just make your mouth water, don't it, that's the way you should be towards God's word, be hungry, and be filled with his word, <laughs> hey, something to think about, are you hungry, I am, let's see about digging in and getting in there and, and doing our part too, and, and feeding people some real meat, and let's Let's leave the scrappings out in the garbage and let's get the real meat on the table. And you know what I'm talking about too. Let's preach Jesus Christ. Let's talk about the message at the cross. Time is too short for all this me, me, me stuff and, and, and you, you, you stuff and all this. I mean, let's, let, let's start getting the message out there time we we get rid of that and start putting Jesus back on the table he is the real bread of life <laughs> Shalom and ha ho God bless you and remember me in your prayers and let us pray for one another okay God bless you all I love you all ha ho